because I'm, oh, I made it to Friday. It's Friday. Last night I, um, I went to sleep. I went to bed at like 7.30 and I was reading. But by 8 o'clock I was like, all right, that's it. I'm done reading. And I was asleep at 8 o'clock. And at 5.30 this morning when my alarm came off, I was all Yosemite Sam. I just wanted to jump up and down and start screaming. But, uh, well, at least I only have one more work day. So, and I have um, two breaks and a lunch coming up. So it's going to be fine. It's going to be absolutely fine. Nothing new has happened. Um, next week, I'm going to have to get my blood drawn. I might give it a little bit of an extra week. Um, I know I keep saying I'm quitting sodas, but I have sodas again. Um, and I'm going to give it maybe an extra week. It was a little swollen this morning. Again, less swollen. And you can't see it before you, this part, my upper abdomen. I don't know where the liver is. was um sticking out a little bit. You could see it. It'll like the fit of my clothes. Uh, and it's it's a lot more flat now and the skin is um, you know you can pull some skin. It's not taut. So there's slack. Although I don't have as much saggy skin as you think considering I lost you know like 200 pounds. So I'm very lucky on that front. I do have my my upper arms those sort of hang loose. And some of my stomach skin, but otherwise, pretty good. I'll take it at 46. I'll take it. A little bit of saggy skin is not the end of the world. Uh, I think the jaundice is gone for my eyes again. It was only ever in the corners, and I know you can't really see it on the video, but I'm pretty sure that's gone. Um, I'm able to get plenty of exercise. I'm doing okay. The itch isn't great, but that's not really indicative of you know, disease stage, so it comes and it goes. I, um, I have this uh, metal back scratcher, and one of the things about LPBC is that it causes, for me at least, and I think for others, a lot of the itches on the palms and the hands and the soles of the feet awful. It's awful. So I have this metal back scratch and I'll just rake it across the bottoms of my feet because it itches so hard. And, and I also have uh, f uh, peel foot masks that I do every so often. Not crazy often. I, I mean, I don't get a huge buildup of calluses anyway. Um, it's it's not that much. So I, go, I have to go months and months and months bef between because otherwise I'll just be taking off some good skin. It, but it is fun to do it when I do it. So I try to take as good a care of my feet as possible. I haven't put nail polish on them in a while. But it's all there for when I want to. It's just... I'm worried too much about staying alive. <laughs> and staying healthy for as long as possible. Like, the nail polish can wait. Been, uh... Been relatively quiet this week. I feel like, um, work has taken over and that's okay. Work rarely takes over, so I can give it a few a few days here and there. It's a good job. I like my coworkers. I like my bosses. And um, I really want to move up. And it's not necessarily because of the money. I mean, yes, that's lovely and I need it, but I've never been more than a two level before. And... Uh, I think I have, I know I have the capacity to do anything. I know I'm smart enough and I'm good enough. I just, something about a woman with autism on her own, with no guidance and no help, dude, it's, it's bleak. It's hard. You know, people are helped up by other people. That's how it happens. And I haven't had that and I haven't known how to get it. So I'm just, I'm just trying trying in this job it's it's not easy and and most people go through this long before before now but it happens for us at different times um 
still haven't heard from my mom. I, it's not that I'm testing or waiting. It's just that I'm living my life day to day and I try not to think of the fact of the idea that I have that my mom doesn't really take this seriously. Um, I, I, I don't know why. I, I just thought that I imagined that uh, the act of, you know, blowing someone in your body would create a bond that apparently it didn't. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so I'm gonna leave it there because I gotta do work. I can't do this today. So thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.